So I left into college. First day in all that. No, thanks. I've got registration later on. You okay? Yeah. I'm just happy to have you both home now. You, um, had a nightmare last night. Yeah. Keep on this dream where Seb's crying for his mum and she's out there lost and scared and confused and we can't get to her. I should have done more. And why did I believe Lachlan when he said that Rebecca had gone away for good? I let Seb down. And why? Because I was enjoying it being just us four for once and not having to worry about her. Hiya. What kind of dad does that make me? Do you want to hang out? Yeah, I've got college later, but we can go to the cafe now if you want. Yeah, cool. The police are up at home farm. They've got dogs. Joe reckons they're looking for Rebecca's body. Well, if they are, they're idiots, because she's still alive. She has been missing for a while. Maybe we should prepare ourselves for the worst case scenario. None of this is your fault, you know. Yeah, and that fire that killed my stepmom Sarah wasn't either. But I was angry and bitter about it for years. I mean, what this, what's this going to do for Seb if, he, if we can't find his mum? It's going to screw him up just like it did me. No, it won't, because he's got us. Two parents who love him. I want to bring you up to feel happy and safe and secure. Yeah, I know that. But don't you get why I can't just let this go? How can I face my son later if I just give up? Uh, cheese and ham toasty and a coffee to go, please, Robin. And two coffees and a tea to stay, please, mate. Hi, right, Doug. Oh, keep him busy, you know. Have you heard? I'm doing up the community garden as a tribute to Jerry. I've got a contact on the council. He's been very supportive. In fact, I'm hoping, I'm hoping that he'll come and open it. Yeah, it's a splendid idea. It was a, looking a bit of a state before, and Jerry was a very community spirited boy. Yeah, you'll be chuffed with that, Doug. Aye. I was. Uh... Sorry to hear that the police were out looking for Rebecca's body today. Maybe we should think about something in her memory, too. Lockham's refusing to say what he's done with her, but you give me five minutes in a room with him and I'll... I'll find out where he's buried her. I can't listen to this. Rodney, scratch that order, please. 